Hi. Good morning, everybody. How's everybody doing? Hope uh, all post uh, post turkey hangovers are taken care of, and you're ready to play some secret ponchos with us. Um, as as you all know, I only have a few I seconds to tell you about this place called Kura, but, uh, but I only the need. PS4 network is down. So we're we're back playing the PC version. Well, I shouldn't say back. We're we're happy to be playing the PC version with the PC guys. So we'll uh, we'll get some games going soon. I'm trying to get my computer fired up here. It's stuck. Steam stuck loading. But Tony and uh, Jared are here, and uh, they're they're ready to go. I'm uh, I'm assuming. Yeah, totally ready. Oh yeah. Hi right. guys. Hey. Everybody have a good Christmas break. Yes. It was yes. good until I got Thomas. sick. <laughs> yeah, I hear you, Tony. Yeah. Santa, Santa brought me that present on Christmas Eve. I must have been a very, very bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, my wife was was worse than I was, though. So uh, that uh, made me feel okay. Yeah, not at all. Um, as gamer husband knows, there's nothing like two sick parents having to look after two sick kids. It's like the worst combination possible. Are you guys in and ready to go? Yeah, ready. Yes. You wanna search for a match? Yeah. Search it. So, um, today we don't have um, Chris or Spiffy or Yusuf. They're they're um, doing some family stuff, so so it's just the three of us, which is fun. Yeah, hey, you stuck with us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no pretty picture on the webcam. It's tempting to show you guys what I look like right now because it is not good. <laughs> I look like a homeless man. My hair is all over the place. Are you in One your uh, pajamas? Yeah, I'm in my jammies, but I just look down and I like somehow spilled breakfast all over them. We got like food stains. It's it's awesome. I, I look pretty hot right now. Mm, well. At least one person thinks so. <laughs> um, someone, someone on the on the chat asked if um, why Punch was dead. Um, you bought it. Are you playing the PC version of the PS4? Um, because the PS4 right now, the PSN network is totally um, currently down, so no one's been able to play that. Play on the PS4 right now. Um, we're in the last two days. Um, on the PC, we're still in early assets. Uh, there, there's a pretty hardcore um, group of people that are probably online right now and playing. Um, and uh, yeah, it's, we're we're gonna like go back and support the, uh, the PC version as quickly as we can. Um, and then we'll probably do a full release, and then we should be able to um, you know get players back on the servers, and it'll be it'll be back. Everything will be up to date at that point. Yeah, it's just it's just the the nature of being such a small group. We uh, we've been pretty transparent about it all along, um, or at least we hope we have. We've tried to be very clear that we're we just can't do we couldn't release both at the same time and support both properly at the same time. So I mean, the PC guys got early access first, and now the early access is sort of in a slower cycle. While we um, get all the fixes up for the PlayStation Four. But the good news for the PC guys is, is that we'll be releasing uh, big patches and stuff like that very soon in the future, and uh, you'll get all the stuff the PS4 guys got, and the, the full final release of the PC game will be um, a very robust, uh, different version than what you're playing right now. So it's, it's kind of like leapfrogging one over the other until we can get everything um, sort of nicely neat and tucked in, but um, bear with us. We uh, we still we still support all the PC guys. We uh, as Jin and all those guys know we we come in and play whenever we can, and we make sure we uh, get guys on for the weekly streams to play PC with you guys. And, and so there's at least the Saturday morning time to come and play. And uh, yeah, d I, stick with us. We uh, we promise it'll be a it'll be a pretty pretty big community soon. Uh, Doll Parts is asking about going to stream from the community side, like the viewpoint. I don't even know what that is. Do you guys know what the viewpoint is? No. I'm, I'm guessing it's about to host uh, other people's streams. Is that the idea? 
I think um, um, with Twitch on the PC at least you can have um, you can link people's Twitch if you watch on your channel. Oh wow. Whoa, really? Yeah. So well, we like definitely need to figure that out if we do a tournament. Nice one, Mr. Brian. Yeah, dirty. I took you out as well. Yeah, he did. Little <laughs> got trigger happy this morning. All right, we gotta stick together here. We're not gonna get anywhere. Let me chase. Where are you? Uh, just oh, me. Thanks, gamer husband. I see how it works. Well, I don't see how it works, but I see the potential. Man, that's awesome. Okay, I'm gonna stun him, and then you can then you can hit him. Oh, if I can actually hit him. Oh, talk to you soon. Jen. <laughs> Is that your con impression? Yeah. <laughs> I played against him last night, two versus one, and he destroyed us. It's too good. Oh! Where is everybody? There we go. Oh, hey, the silence. I, I didn't notice you were in here. Uh, no, we're not releasing games yet. <laughs> I think you were asking last week about... You, you really wanted to know about those two new characters. I think you were, you were all over questions about them last week. We, uh... But yeah, we we're not releasing names yet. The names we give away stuff about the characters. That's uh, that's why. A lot of people. <coughs> well, what I can promise is uh, the new character. They're very different than the current five, so it's Apparently almost like a. Been, the game. It's a very. It makes the game feel very different if you play those two. So. They, yeah. I, yeah. They add a lot. We're testing it. It's like wow, this game is. Yeah, and it's it's one of the things that, that you know we, we we have taken some criticism and uh, and and maybe maybe I don't know if I'll say rightly so, but I understand where people are coming from that that our character we only have five characters and and uh, but we've we've maintained all along we'd rather do deep characters and and that's what these guys are is two really deep interesting characters that every time they come into the game it changes you know the the type of uh, game that you play. Yeah. Hi. And they're fun. They look totally different. They're uh, they're they're cool. Oh, Yusuf's on. Let me add him. I'll, after the sudden death. Or Kaylee, do you want to drag Yusuf in the, into the call? Yeah, sure. I'll add him. Sudden death. All right. Jared. Love this. Okay, stick together. Thanks. There we go. There we go, hey, useful. Dude. Hey, hey. Hey, guys. Hey, use. Sudden death, eh? The best. Oh, Tony, we got a request when you have a second to turn the game volume down. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice yeah. one. Alright. Turning game volume down. Sup, guys. Sudden death, eh? I've got, I think someone's Skype is on. I have like a weird lag of. Are you guys hearing that? The lag of someone else talking? I, I think someone's got uh, Twitch. Yeah, well, oh, yeah. Got, oh, yeah, Twitch. It was me. I turned up all the chaos mobs at once. <laughs> <laughs> so, Yus, I don't know if you're uh, up to speed on everything right now or not, but the PSN network's down. We're playing PC with the PC guys. North Korea and, and answering PS4 questions to anyone who's got them. Was it North Korea? No, not these guys. These, these are just a bunch of jerks. No, I mean the the took down. Oh, the the took down PSN. Yeah, it's the lizard lizard group, whatever they're called. It's lizard. Not, not the Koreans. I don't. I think the North Koreans don't even have internet right now. I think the somebody somebody decided to teach them about hacking. As we should be careful. We should be careful what we say publicly here. Over here. <laughs> As if we didn't have enough obstacles with our launch without <laughs> Lizard Squad hacking PSM. I know. Hey, maybe we should uh, contact the Lizard Squad to to look into um, helping us uh, punch through some of those net problems. I don't think they fix things, Tony. I think they just <laughs> break things. They're like they're like three year old children. <laughs> It's like asking your kid to put back together a, like a broken <laughs> uh, piece of pottery or something. Offer them a job.
Oh boy. Okay, I am almost there. Almost See, there. You're, one, you're one to talk about that community after your your extensive BBSing background. Oh yeah, you're right. We don't need to talk about that stuff here, though. <laughs> I don't know if we can uh, be charged with anything 20 years into the future. For drawing pictures. Statue and yeah. reputation. As a teenager, I don't uh, take any responsibility for my actions. No, it's not how it works. <laughs> <laughs> Never happened. Doctor Doctor Ruckus is saying he's not getting any sound, and so is the silence. Did you turn your sound rate off, Tony? No, I turned it. I can oh. hear you guys. Oh wait, no, I can't. Turn off Twitch. Gamer husband's claiming that Lizard Squad members follow his Twitter account. Is that complaining or? I don't know. I don't know what that means. Is he just? Try are you trying to sound really cool? No, <laughs> he's trying. He's trying to say, "Shut up, guys, or you're gonna get hacked next." <laughs> Well, this point. You know what, then we should tweet them. If they could tweet hack PSN next month instead, or we're not the PSN game. Yeah, the game of the month. Yeah. So, Yus, what's the last day that um, we. Because we started on the 2nd, right? December 2nd. Do we go yeah. until January 2nd, or is it January no, 1st that's the I, last day? I, th I think that they rotate the games the first Tuesday of every month. So, it might be the 6th, I'm guessing, I don't know. Like, I'm not like a Sony spokesperson, but that's the pattern I've seen, that it's the second Tuesday every month. So tell all your friends, you guys out there that have PS4s, that, uh, you know, the month the month is almost over of, of free secret ponchos, so go, go download it as soon as the network gets fixed. Uh, let me go see what the first Tuesdays. Yeah, you're right, the 6th. Awesome. Uh, Tony. Hi. That wasn't very good, was it? No, no. You should invite me. <laughs> Let me. Yeah, that was <coughs> that was pretty brutal. There goes all my bounty. <laughs> hey, cool Python. Yeah, we've. Uh, I, I, I'm assuming since you're you're referencing the forum that you've seen our our response to uh, the trophy stuff, and that's something we'll, we're we're going to discuss. We just have um, bigger things to fry right now. Uh, but we'll we'll definitely we'll definitely look at it and, and talk about it and, and see if it needs changing. Um, I, as you know by now, by reading the forum stuff, we're we're always open to talking about stuff like that, the community, and uh, working on it, working on improving things. Oh man, we learned so much from the PS4 launch that's going to help the PC launch. It's uh, crazy. Like we, um, yeah, we should all have a little meeting about that too soon. But but man, there's going to be some good stuff that the PC launch is going to benefit from. Is that Lucy, Tony? Yep. <clears throat> okay, guys, I'm uh, I'm, I'm in, in, in Pontius now. If any of you, uh, yeah, you, part yeah, you should hook up with Casper. If we got split up. I'm playing with uh, Jin right now. Okay, I'm inviting you, Kaylee. Yeah. We, we, me and Jared just got destroyed. If you guys didn't see that, but <laughs> that was sad. Is um hit. Detection after stun being looked at for the next patch. Um, is that in reference to? I think it's Kid uh, Red. Killer's knife or Kid Red. Kid Red knockdown. I problem probably. Right, right. I think that one. Um, yeah, I think that'll be a little while before we look at that one. Um, Can you send me another invite, Tony? Yep. Oh, is this? Are you Sin? Yep. <laughs> okay. That's my wife's account. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. I was like, no, I'm not playing with you. I'm in the middle of a stream. Uh, okay. Good to go. Oh, when you shoot, when you stun someone with deserter and then you shoot, it doesn't register. Does that do that on PC or PS4? He's he's talking about PS4. The silence is a is one of our PS4 guys. Oh, okay. And um, if you stun someone with the body check and then you shoot them, it doesn't register? Uh, I think what happened is the uh, the collision, the gun, they, they get too close and then it's the, um, the hit volume. Uh, well, the gun is going through the person when they shoot. Oh, I see, okay. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, I, I 
the way I play, I've never seen that, but I might be spacing myself a little bit different. I didn't realize actually that some people were having that problem. So yeah, we'll take a look at it. If um, silence, if you ever feel, or Tony, do you know exactly what the problem is, or, or should we get someone to send us a video of it? Uh, I think I know the problem, and I think silence and some of those guys on the forum has been sending videos on Sweet. our forum. So they're actually the PS4. Those so, videos are yeah, so amazing. helpful. Yeah, those helpful. Those videos that you guys sent really just pinpoint a problem, you know, and then. See yeah, it's, it's it's super hard for us to read read instructions and then try to reproduce a bug. Well, it's because we do it, we try it, but <clears throat> having we'll, video is the best. It's because we'll probably like stun them and then aim and shoot the same way that we always do. That it's fine, and then we're like, hey, it's broken. And then if someone's doing it a different way, it's really good to see the subtleties. Yeah, and it's hard to explain <laughs> things, right? Like it, like with a lot of the bugs now that we've taken care of what we consider to be the big ones, it's like little intricate tiny things that we just overlook or so it's really, really helpful to see videos. Like character wipes. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we agreed never to talk about yeah. those. <laughs> the first the first <laughs> rule of character wipes, don't talk about character wipes. <laughs> especially now the chipper voice. Oh my god. Fire Firecat and I uh, want to thanks to Firecat. Give me a give me a taste of how it feels to win. <coughs> Tony, where are you at? I'm at the house, the construction. Do we have any? Um, do we have any one in the community that plays both a lot, PC and PS4? Doll parts, right? I think uh, Chevy plays on both, but um, I don't know. But I think he's he's more in the the. The PC. Did you right, see that, Tony? That was like synchronized swimming, or synchronized killing. That's what we we do, dropped man. them at the exact same time. That's what we do. It's beautiful. I wouldn't be saying that if it was us that had died at the same time. Okay, we got him separated. Let's uh, let's take out this kid red. Oh. Sorry. Oh. Nice. Tony, Chris, oh. say, Chris was able to find what, PS4 web cameras in my office. Yep. Man, it's a mess in here. I left some on the couch downstairs for you guys, but... Run, Kaylee, do what you do best. <laughs> <laughs> and he got away. <laughs> so, how is Deserter? I saw someone say, can you nerf the Deserter? And I remember on PC, he was a lot stronger, and we actually implemented a lot of fixes for him on um, PS4 to make him a little weaker. Is Are people feeling on PS4 he's still too tough? I see people complaining about Deserter on PS4 a lot more than... Like, I have, we haven't seen the same volume in the forums and <clears throat> on Twitter and stuff of, of complaints about Deserter that we saw with the PC, that's for sure. I see, um, I see sort of a... Complaints about each character being too tough. Yeah, so, yeah, I see, yeah. He's like right on par with all the others. In, in yeah. What I'm seeing, but which is a good thing. I was wondering if we should shorten his evade um, range, but I don't know because it's useful for him to get away. The one thing I have heard um, a few people request is that maybe there's only one heal a game. Yeah, I think increasing the cooldown on it would be good. And one person, uh, and this is something I think, but it isn't something that I've seen a lot of. Uh, just one other guy who thinks the same as me was that the using the um, the what's it called the you know like the the boost, um, the speed boost or whatever also yeah. uses also uses um, like that takes your recharge. Yeah, yeah. So that can only do one one or the other, like med kit or boost. Yeah, I think the heal frequency is still, even though we turned it down quite a bit on the PS4, it's still probably, in one versus one, it's still, they can do it too many times. Hey, Kaylee, let them is, come to us. Is the uh, the group heal volume still pretty big? Yeah, we want to really shrink that, too. I think it's so you have to stand right next to them. Yeah. Uh, I actually want to make it so it's, like, interruptible. That's good. And I really, my my favorite thing I want to do, we never get a chance to do it, we always talk about it, is 
make kid red so he drops his dynamite if he's cooking it and you shoot him. Yeah. You, what? I love, Wait. I love that the, you want to uh, do that or you? The dynamite and the knives all have uh, real collision on them now. So when you're, when you're throwing them, you can hit things out of the the air. Like one knife will knock the other knife out of the air, or a knife to dynamite. Right, awesome. right. We did it, Tony. A level of choice? No, no, no. I think that's just no. I just level one. That was a good match. That was good. You guys are the best. <laughs> Chilly. You want me All to right, keep playing Phantom in. or? No, play whoever you want. What's the uh? What is what's the med kit while sliding glitch? Oh, if you use the medic to heal, and then you can. Switch weapon very quickly, you can walk again. But your heal is like kind of um like long. Oh yeah. Oh okay. Oh that's interesting. I haven't seen that one in the wild before. Yeah, Twizzy Kids, we were we were talking just a little bit earlier about the, the adrenaline, uh maybe making that use a recharge as well. Like the recharge the same recharge as the med kit or something like that. I sent you another invite, Kaylee. You, uh, yeah, ex oh, I thought I accepted. There we go. Gamer husband said, have we look at the bug where he kills everybody, but still loses matches. <laughs> <laughs> but gamer husband loses matches. Yeah. That's There's no helping that bug, gamer. <laughs> You're asking for miracles now. Yeah, I think even making the heal take longer, a little longer, like two seconds longer or something, would, would make it like harder to use. Hey, Fallen Hero, yeah, the PSN's still down. Yeah, you're, you're watching us play the PC version, uh, our early access version with the, with the PC community. So you'll notice some things are a little bit different, but... Oh, we got separated, Tony. Yeah. Alright, fight you again. Yeah, we, we, we don't really go and nerf character. We just try to... Like, if you if you actually play the game on early assets and then compare it to the PC version, we what we did, we just fix it so it's working as intended and making sure it's um, it feels um, good. Um, and we might like tune some of the numbers very little, but none of we we have yet to really like totally nerf a character and take out a mechanic because we think the mechanics are like are pretty good and they work pretty well. Um, yeah, but it's just some of the bugs make them somewhat exploitable, and we just fix those. Oh man, we got split again. Okay, well just go ahead without me. Okay. I'm still searching for a match. I saw somebody, was it Dr. Ruckus, asking a question about the, fl the that he, he was having problems with friends still. Um, we did we did do some fixes on the fine friends, <clears throat> and it and most people it seemed to have helped. But are you? I'm assuming, Doctor Ruckus, that you're still having issues splitting from your friends. Can you give us any more information about what game modes you're playing? What did you invite me? Or is or is your comment going back to like two weeks ago or something like that before we had released the fixes? Let's restart my game. That's a good idea, I should probably do that too. Oh. 
I got an error with my game. I think uh, that's why we got split up. Uh, I got it. Might be it. Might be a network problem. Oh, weird. Steam's like re-verifying that I have an account. It's like maybe my someone tried to hack my account. <laughs> the lizard guys heard me talking. <laughs> They're quick. Uh, yeah, that was fast. Well, you must I be a could... celebrity to for them to hack you, though. Know? Oh, well, then we know that that's not what's happening. Um... There we go. Alright, I should be back in in a sec. Uh, feel free to invite Jared, or uh, I don't know if Yus is uh, a PC fired up. Okay, Tony, I am back in game. All right. Are you in the middle of a match? Yeah, I'm with Jared right now. Okay, cool, I'll just wait for you guys. If someone just touches me, I'm dead to die. Like, zero HP. Whoa. There will be a live interview with Lizard Group on BBC. Oh man, I feel like people are just giving the Lizard Group what they want at this point. But who knows, maybe maybe they actually have a reason for what they're doing. It sure doesn't seem like it though. Oh. Uh. What happened to the killer? He dropped. Where is he hiding? Uh, standing. You know what? While you guys are playing, I'm gonna raffle. Yay, uh, raffle! A, I'm gonna raffle a soundtrack off. Give me about five seconds here, guys, and uh. You guys win in the game? Nope. <laughs> Tied up. Two versus one. Oh! I was letting you, uh. Oh, one versus one him. There, let me. Let me oh! I've got a. I've got a distraction. It's a one and a half year, year old distraction while we're trying to play. Chicken salad? I'm sure he doesn't appreciate chicken me calling that. Win. You won the raffle, chicken salad. Congratulations. Chicken salad. Hey, Jared, do you want me to let me find him? Do it. You know what I've never actually seen? I've never seen turkey salad. Like a turkey salad sandwich. Is there a reason for that? It's a bit of a digression from the game, I know. But you never see turkey salad sandwiches. There's a lot of um non non meat product sandwich that's missing. <laughs> <laughs> Like they just need to have salad added, added to the end of it? Yeah. Like ham, ham salad sandwich? That just sounds disgusting. Turkey salad is for plebeians. Yeah, okay. It's true actually, turkey turkey meat is, uh, is a lot cheaper than chicken meat. Is it? Yeah. Oh man. Yeah, if, you, if you like, if you, if you like, um, break out like cost per weight, turkey is actually cheaper than chicken. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> these, are the, these are the things a dad on a budget figures out when he's at a grocery store. Uh, this is the Poncho's Q&A about sandwiches. Yeah. 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 I'm sorry about that. I had to go and mute for a while with the baby going crazy. And then, yeah, well, you, you didn't miss much. We were talking about chicken versus turkey salad, so... <laughs> This is why we have 
31 viewers. <laughs> <laughs> I think it went up actually. I think we were at like 28 right before we started. Maybe oh, that's the key. Yeah, we, let's talk about Simon just guys. <laughs> people, are, people everywhere are tweeting. There's a really interesting uh, <laughs> the endless debate about chicken and turkey is finally being settled. Why aren't there ham salad sandwiches? We're just ensuring that the lizard group never wants to bother our streams. So, um, <clears throat> something interesting we should throw out there is I've been trying to wrap my head around this about, um, you know when we have the penalties for like le people leaving the match? It, it Before we had that, people were leaving a lot when they were losing and um, so that they wouldn't lose bounty. And once you put that in, it really made an incentive for you to finish your match because you're going to lose more bounty if you quit than if you just lose honorably, right? Um, so to solve, solve that problem, the only problem now is the game has no idea if you, you know, if you unplug your internet or if you get disconnected, like, unfairly, you know? Um, so I guess we, we in the community have to kind of figure out, well... You know, it's either going to be strict on people who quit and a little unfair on people who get disconnected, or it's going to be fair for people who disconnect and really lenient on people who just quit. You know, and uh, so pretty much, like, no matter which way we design it, the system will end up kind of, we either have to decide if we have to make it more lenient so that people people might be getting pet by penalized too harshly if they quit or crash or something. But then the only way to do this is to lo loosen up the penalty on people that leave. What do you guys think? Yeah, it's definitely a case of like some group is gonna be unhappy, but we have to do it because it was like a on the PC. I don't. I, everyone here might not know, but in the beginning on the PC, it was a huge problem. Like people were leaving matches like crazy. So I, I think how it is right now is. Um, uh, it's, it's the best that I can think of. It's the best system I can think of. Some people have mentioned in the forums and stuff doing like um, a system for people who are lag, where you 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 vote them out. But I, that's not necessarily fair because the lag isn't always the person who looks like they're lagging, right? Right. Like it could be because it kind of depends who gets into a match first and stuff like that too. Who's like moving around the screen? I don't know. It's tough. If anyone has any ideas, <laughs> throw them out there. I, what I'm, I'm thinking of doing is loosening it a little bit, but just making sure it doesn't lead to a tidal wave of people quitting. You know, like maybe. What do you mean, like like lowering the punishment amount? Lowering the punishment so it's like if you leave once, you get a warning, and then if you leave again within 24 hours, you you then you get a huge penalty, like a bigger penalty. Um, but that way. That way, if someone just gets like freak accident booted or something, or they ha really have to go, like their house is on fire or something, they don't get, uh, they don't get a penalty. But I mean, it's it's the same thing that I said earlier, though. But by doing that, you basically, if people want to quit, you give them one free quit every day. Then, right? So it's still not the best. I don't know. It's anything you do to decrease um, unfair punishment to innocent people is gonna make it easier for other people. To quit. I get a lot of messages every day in my email about people who just got unfairly disconnected and then really madly lost the bounty. Yeah, no. Oh, it's dull parts in Firecat. Yep. Alright. Here, stay close to me. So, Omega um, Bizdi says he would love to see pings while playing. Um, yeah, um, are you playing PS4 or are you playing PC? Because on the PS4 and coming to the PC, we actually installed all the ping bars so you can actually see someone if they have like one bar in their red connection or, or you know, four bars in their green, that kind of stuff. And it really helps because you can like see basically who's lagging and that kind of stuff. Um, or do you mean you want to see the actual specific number?
And for those of you asking questions, um, raises a good point actually. Now that we have like the PC crowd and the police station crowd, when you ask a question, uh, you may or may not recognize your name, so maybe just specify what version you're playing, if, if you have a specific about um, like in-game stuff. But th those, those light bars are going to really benefit the P PC guys when those get patched in. Yeah, yeah, for sure. How weak the bars was we said one bar is is below I think it was 300 milliseconds so anything that's red red bar it just means the game she shouldn't be playing the game really um, two bars is around 250 and it's playable still and it's when you, when someone has yellow like two bars it, the game's still fine and it's not glitching out or anything but red bars are when you start seeing stuff glitch because they're like playing at less than 300 milliseconds, and then anything over yellow, like yellow or over, is, is supported, so it, it plays fine. Yellow is just a good indication, like, don't go start downloading some files or something. Oh. Oh. How's the battle? It was good. The dull part was, uh, very, very whippy. <laughs> <laughs> that was good, lots of back and forth. It was very Devo. <coughs> yeah. Devo games. <laughs> Nerf deserted to Strong. The heck is Strong? Strong? It's, it's lead speak, I think. Oh, too strong? Yeah. Those young young people nowadays. I, you know what's funny? I never find Deserter too strong because the character I play the most, uh, is Killer, is really good against Deserter. So <laughs> yeah, it's true. So I'm always like, when I see Deserter, I'm like, oh, this will be easy, you know? But when, I think for like guys like Kid Red and stuff, Deserter is really tough. I think that's the, <coughs> I think that's the worst matchup for a 1v1, um, for a Kid Red player, is Deserter. Yeah. It is for me, anyway. It's all about just keeping away, like keeping distance and trying to chip them down, but then they they heal <laughs> every time. Yeah. But anyway, it's nice though. Everyone's got that matchup, right? I think like... Actually, oh, yeah. I think Killer's kind of the most well-balanced. Who's the hardest one with Killer, you think? Oh, I have a hard time against Matador. With, cause Matador oh, moves. right. Yeah, that makes because sense. Killer, Killer, you have to... Sh if you miss a shot, you're kind of screwed because you have a long, a slow fire rate. And so, and Matador moves so fast, it's really hard to hit that precision shot with her, you know, so. Yeah. You can fan the hammer, but then you're you're exposed, you gotta reload. Yeah, yeah. Matador's really, even though, yeah, Matador's really good against Killer, just because his, his aim needs to be so precise and she moves so quick. Right, and Killer doesn't have, like, the body check or anything to get him out of trouble. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. I hear zombies now. Yeah, I yeah that was creepy. Yeah. Was zombie. Christmas zombie. That's an, actually it's actually amazing the zombies haven't invaded. Zombies are everywhere now in all like culture. I, I'm amazed they haven't invaded Christmas. Oh, I see zombie Christmas. Yeah, I heard there was a nativity scene, which was full zombified. Oh, okay. And the guy was asked to take it down. <laughs> That's, uh, do the devs have plans on making that nurse the server skin? All over it. <laughs> hey Chicken Salad, thanks for following us. Um, also, I just wanted to mention if you don't, this has happened before and I've sent off uh, prizes through Twitch, if you don't see it in your mailbox, check um, check your, what, what they call your spam, but it's called Other in, in Twitch. It might be, it might be sitting in there. So yeah, if you don't see it in your email, check it out. <laughs> Do you guys check out that um, form thread of um, all that? Oh man, those are so good. I know. I was like, I was, I was like, I was and like, the quality is so amazing. On those. Yeah. Here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna post it to the stream. They're, uh, they're, they're amazing. Did, did, did he, did he ever do a matador? Yeah, is a librarian with, uh, you know, like th those wooden stick with newspaper. That's the cape. Oh man, this, so this, 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 this is my, my favorite thing on the forum. The yeah. quality is so good too. He's he's so he's talented. Oh, Dash Zero is he in the stream right now? Oh, 
What? What? That's, that's zero. Are you in the stream? Yeah, you're not seeing these use. I'm, no. post, I'm posting a link in the. Uh, I'm posting a link in the in the Twitch feed. Uh, check it out. You're, you're gonna love these. We've got we've got a new set of skins ready. <laughs> and we we didn't even have to pay. Uh, we didn't even have to pay anyone to do them. <laughs> they're they're incredible. Every time I see a new one, it's my favorite too. As long as it's not the Victoria's Secret ponchos flying up again. Yeah, that was hilarious. What was that one called? Swimsuit? I can't remember. Yeah, that's not go back to that. Yeah. Oh yeah, there's Matador. <laughs> Is that a shish kebab? That's awesome. No, thank you for doing those fan um, art. Yeah, are you kidding me, Dash? Those are, they're amazing. Are you, hey Dash, are you okay if we post these to Twitter? Or if, you, if you're on Twitter, tweet them and put our name in and we'll retweet them. But do one, like one a day or something, because they're, they're so good. I don't think we should, uh, we should blow it all at once. Yeah, if you post them, if you post them, we'll retweet them. These are great. I know, they're amazing. I'm, so, I'm, I'm sad that, uh, it's like inspiration for us to get our new characters out there just so we can see what Dash does with the new ones. <laughs> yeah. Really, really good art skills. You don't need Jose anymore. <laughs> <laughs> which, which one's your favorite? I really like the drawing of Kid Red the best. Yeah. Um, like, it's just a, it's a great drawing. I, I like I like the killer, flash prices. Yeah, I like I like um, Matador Librarian. It's just got the right attitude on her. I didn't see that Matador Librarian. It's on page yeah. two. Oh, there's. Oh, page two. the 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 Poncho Mime is pretty awesome. I don't know. They're so good. They're all good. Yeah, but Killer made me laugh the hardest. Like slashing prices. Yeah. Yeah. Brilliant. And you just know that like. You, you, you're gonna be a, a grumpy jerk if your job. You're that old and you're working at <laughs> Walmart. <laughs> you obviously didn't save for retirement. That's his. Back, that's Killer's backstory. Uh, he didn't save for retirement. He works at works at the Wild West Walmart. He, he, he's from the future. He found a time machine and go back to the past to be a killer. And he, if he if he. Let's his mom make out with him, then he disappears from the future. <laughs> <laughs> That's the weirdest movie ever. But all, but awesome. It was pretty. It's a pretty good movie. I was. I was away. reading. Uh, it's a little aside, but it's interesting. The I was reading. Uh, there's. It, it was like when it when it was written. It was legendary. Like it started circulating in Hollywood, and every single director and studio wanted it. Back it was it was considered yeah it was considered the perfect script. It had like it had, there's like all these like key elements that this script should have to like be awesome, and it like nailed every single one of them. And every studio and every director wanted to do it. There's like a massive bidding war for it. Wow. There's like a documentary about just like the script Back to the Future when it came out. Good old Marty. Hey, and you know what? Next year, in two days, three days, it's 2015, which is uh, Back to the Future 2. Yeah, and the new stuff. And we have stuff. hoverboards. Hoverboards and Neon. Neon's gonna come back right that day. Neon? Yeah. Don't you remember how they were all dressed in like neon? Okay. Oh yeah, they had like lights on their jackets and stuff, right? Yeah. And those shoes. <coughs> oh, that's cool, Silence. Silence, who's your uh, who's your main character? Are you still like top of the leaderboard? I haven't looked at the leaderboard in like a, a week or so. So where the leaderboards? We're looking at the idea of seasonal leaderboards in the long term of the game. Um, that would be pretty exciting. To see last last season's winners, next season's winners. Is the season? How long is the season? Is it like a three month cycle? Um, 
I think we'll probably start with just two seasons a year, you know, and then um, just just because we have no idea what it, how it's going to explode in our faces, so we might as well start small and then, you know what I mean? Mm hmm And build over there, but I, I think two a year is good. What does Warcraft 3 do, Tony? Or Starcraft? Uh, I think they have quarters. They're, they, I think they do four seasons. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Every, I think every like two months or three months they tally all the the points and then they they give out those high cons. How'd you guys do? You won. Kaylee, you want to hop on or? Yeah, yeah, bring me in. And then I'll, I'll raffle another soundtrack after we're done. Let's hope it doesn't split us up. Shouldn't now that I've verified my account. <laughs> oh, hey, machine. Um, Bloodbed was um, something that um, we wanted to do. And what it is, is before going to a match, you can put in your bounty as a bed so and then if you win the match you'll get you know whatever's on the on the pool and if you lose then you lost your bed um, and we wanted to do it but we didn't have enough time to properly execute it so we um, push for the odd system instead uh, but you know something we would totally like to bring back when we have time to do it properly yeah, even if we could just do it for like the really high ranking guys, you know, like maybe maybe it'd be cool if we could trigger it once you get to like legendary or something like that, and then it gives those guys added incentive to play each other or something. I don't know. I, I love the idea. Yeah, there's so many things that we want to do to build from what we have right now and to build the game up, and I think it's just it's really exciting. We just know first we just got to get our our basic stuff all under control, <laughs> like the um, getting a nice solid PC launch out, you know, getting the new characters out for the PS4 community, um, that kind of stuff is our priority. And then it'll be an exciting year when we start getting to do things like add seasonal leaderboards and stuff like that. Because I'm actually really excited about adding a tutorial, you know, just to get. I think if we add a tutorial, new players will new players will have an easier time getting understanding the game and I think that'll feed it'll provide the foundation for a healthy user base because the guys that play the game a lot are like guys like us that are really like competitive and then I think it scares away a lot of new guys even though the game is super fun even if you're new because you can just run and shoot and stuff but I think people don't get that so Mm-hmm. What's going on with this round, Tony? Hmm? What's going on with this round? We're not getting uh we're, we're missing one dude. Fourth guy. One guy. Come and get it guys. Yeah, I think blood betting would be really cool to do. Um yeah, we have like a lot of things that we we wanted to do so. It'd be interesting to see, um, you know, how the game progresses. And if you want to support us, remember get some skins and buy some soundtracks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that kind of stuff. That extra content really will feed us, so that we can uh, keep expanding the game and making improvements to it. <laughs> Just literally. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, Jake Starman. Um, thanks for those videos you've been doing. You know, they're really good tutorial videos, and um, I'll try my best to um, spread them to over the internet as well. Yeah, anything you guys. I don't think people realize how much it helps um, for people to be involved in like comment sections or giving us reviews on Metacritic, and that stuff goes a long way to building community. So we, a lot of you guys have already gone out and done reviews and stuff like that for us, and we, we really appreciate it. But 
any support you guys can give us is uh, is helpful to everybody. It'll help build a huge base for uh, for the game. Oh yeah, especially if somebody writes like a stupid article and then there's things that we want to say like if it's not accurate, but we it's not it's not uh, appropriate. But then it's always such a good feeling to see our community kind of just jump in and give them like proper information. Like actually, there is a practice mode, or actually there is you know that kind of stuff. And it's um. It's really good. Is that Jared in here? Yep. Jared's a traitor? Or is yeah. he fighting against you? He's fighting against us. Oh my god. We'll teach him a lesson. <laughs> <laughs> Are you still doing some paperwork use? <laughs> yeah. Sorry. No, no. I was just wondering where that sound was coming from. Oh no. Tony, you gotta heal? Yeah. Oh yeah. Look out! Oh no! Oh, they did. That was, that was well done. Yeah, I almost had to heal off. Oh, oh man, they took the lead. Hey, let's get him. Playing well together. Oh man! They're both almost down. Nice, get him! Oh, Tony, that was awesome. He just went on a tear. I'm um, the blue bowling ball. Wow, that sounds really threatening. <laughs> the blue bowling ball? <laughs> yeah. They just knife each other, so that's good. No, we did. Oh no. Oh no! Oh, they got me. They got me. Oh! Nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! All right, well, it looks like it looks like use is taken off, everybody. Thanks for dropping by the feed, use. We'll uh, we'll talk to you soon. Yeah, yeah. Um, thanks, thanks for. Let me sneak in for a while. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, um, talk to you guys soon. Bye bye. Later, you. Okay. We're winning, we should let them come Oh, yeah, yeah, let, let them come to us. Oh, yeah, we got this, Tony. Nice. Uh, close. SBM trader. That's <laughs> <laughs> why they call me dirty. No. There's no team in the well west. Yeah, killer totally reminds me of uh, Clint Eastwood. So skinny and angry. It's like Clint Eastwood from Unforgiven. And smokes cigars. Yeah. Play a little matador. <laughs> thanks, thanks, machinists. Uh, I don't know. There's, there's really been only. It, it's hard to say like if a review is bad or not. There, there. A lot of them have had like fair comments, and we just think that they, uh, they're a little bit harsh. But uh, there's, there's a couple where it just feels like they're being a little, I don't know, sensational. Hyperbolic? Can you say hyperbolic? Hyper using a lot of hyperbole? Is that hyperbolic? Or am I getting confused with the hyperbolic chamber? Hyperbolic sounds like a science term. <laughs> Are you checking? Checking what? Oh, the if you can use it. <laughs> no, 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 I'm, uh, 
I'm not. I'm actually uh, pulling up my list of soundtracks because I'm going to give another one away here. Uh, let me invite Jared then. Yeah, yeah, invite Jared. Uh, this is PC, but the, the frames per second actually isn't better. I think it's just that our feed, when we do a PC, is better. Yeah. That last uh, last week we had a bit of a challenge just getting the settings right for the uh, the feed from the PS4. So I think that's the difference that you're seeing. Yeah, I think the um, open um, open broadcast, the the stream tool we're using, is very very efficient. And my my computer has way better memory than the PS4, so or uh, CPU, so the stream is probably higher quality. Oh, again. Awesome, Dash. As soon as we're done the stream, I'll uh, I'll go in and retweet. Give us, give us one a day. I'll do one. I'll, I'll retweet every day. Me too. Oh, oops. Apparently, I was in a lobby, and uh, now I've got a game going. I don't even know who my teammate is. Who's my teammate? Are you in the stream? You better win. The fans depends on you. <laughs> Yeah, did you give away the soundtrack? No, I was, uh, I, I will be giving it away. I didn't realize that I was, uh, was in the lobby. And now I've got a, got a responsibility to my teammate here to be involved in this match. Where's that matador? Right here. Oh man. They want blood. Whoa, what happened? Oh. <laughs> Jumped right into it, sorry. <laughs> Thought I was gonna sneak it by the side there. Yeah, I was Dol doing the pounds and then. Doll parts. Um, Doll parts was just around the corner. Yeah. Oh, that was brutal. Yep. You're welcome. Oh, no score. Oh, man. Yeah. I am just getting annihilated by Chivy right now. We got wrecked. Wrecked. That was brutal. Oh. Game guys, teach us a lesson. Oh man, I'm. This isn't even close. We got killed in like 20 seconds, literally. Really? Yeah. Who are you guys playing? Doll parts and um. Oh okay. Cats. Were they both poncho? No, one poncho, one killer. Yeah, the uh, PC balance is a little bit uh, different than the PS4. The uh, perk skills actually. Oh, that's my kid saying hi. Hi. Yeah, the PC the PC balance system is totally different. Like Tony was saying, it's uh, we we had like we have perk points, but in in the PS4 version they add like two percent or whatever each time you add one. In the in the in the PC version they add like ten percent. Yeah. So it's huge. Like when you have like eight perk points, you're doing like double, triple damage. So it's uh, that's why you you'll see like Matador can do like a stab and one sword swipe, and it's game over. <laughs> the silence. Is, he's being mean on chat. <laughs> <laughs> no, we haven't um, talked about the new characters yet. We we want to you know keep it a surprise. Yeah, when when we talk about them, we're gonna sort of do it all at once. We're not gonna say, you know, it'll be you'll see pictures, you'll see descriptions and names, and all all at one time. We will be announcing them at the same time, though, as well as the two new maps. And it'll be soon. We're not talking like three months away or anything like that. We'll probably have an announcement in the next couple of weeks. Who are you guys playing against this round? Doll parts and uh... Oh, soundtrack! Jeez. 
Okay, I'm on it. We're doing a draw right now. The winner is Switchblade Monkeys. <laughs> All right, doing another draw. Hold on. I can announce that one. There we go. Slex or SL3X. Ending. Uh, how you want to read it? Congratulations, you won. Uh, you won the raffle. I am sending you a key. If you don't see it in the next five minutes, check your other folder in your Twitch account. Oh, leg. Teleported back. You did? Or they did? Oh, I did. Nice work. Hey, last gambit, we're doing great. Hope you had a great Christmas break. Yeah, yeah, thanks, gamer. I, uh, I think we can make good on that. I don't know. Um, I am just looking up. There we go, soundtrack has been sent. Well, you'll have to let us know what you think of the soundtrack when you, when you get a chance to listen to it, uh, Slex. Ouch. You know what, I'm gonna post, uh, I'm just gonna post a link to the soundtrack for everyone who might be interested. You can get our soundtrack. Oh. <laughs> right. I didn't do that bad. <laughs> no, I don't, I don't think I did that bad either, but... Jeez. can get our soundtrack at the link I just posted. All, all proceeds go to feeding the devs and their families. <laughs> <laughs> and getting you guys new content, I should say. That's, that's the incentive for you. Kitty or Fry? Who wants it? Uh, you, yeah, Jared, you go for it. I'm, uh, sure. I'm just organizing some things here. I'm just gonna switch up my character. Can we add mustache customization for deserter? <laughs> Once upon a time, do you, do you guys remember like the super early uh, versions of the games where we had like? menus where you like customize the colors and stuff like that yeah and then it just became impossible for us to like ever even think about getting the game done <laughs> <laughs> should we have just released that like an outlaw customizer that's what the game would have become we should just make a character that is a mustache <laughs> that sounds like a good plan like moss man but mustache man Mustache you. Yeah. <laughs> you can wear a, a bullet bandolero. Yeah, number of feet SBM. That's an uh, that's an awesome uh, hashtag. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll We're try. a pretty skinny group of developers too, aren't we? We should, we should just show pictures of Yusuf and Chris. Really get that hashtag feed SPM thread. What do you mean a distinct lack of ponchos? There's... I guess there's only one poncho. Two ponchos? Two ponchos. Alternate skin. Maybe we'll start a poncho fund, the silence. You, we'll, we'll do custom ponchos for people. I'm getting... Yeah. 
Oh, the name came from, um... Oh, wow, I just teleported to you. Once, uh, at, the, at the very beginning of the game, we, we, we had, like, a, a development blog. And this is before we... Like, this is when the game is in its early, early uh, versions, and we weren't 100% sure of how it was going to go, where we are going to have the camera, all that stuff. So this is really early on in the process. We had a development blog, and um, we... I don't know where, who came up with what parts of the name, but basically we had to have... We, we wanted it to be a secret, so we called the development blog. Okay, well, it's going to be a secret. And then we're like, well, we need we need something that sounds like Western or Mexican or something like that. And, and somebody recommended ponchos, and so Secret Ponchos was sort of the name of our development blog where we all communicated with each other. Because we all, we all work in different locations. We don't all work out of, like, one office or something like that. Um, we're spread all over the place. So the development blog was the hub of the creation of the game, and it was called Secret Ponchos. And then... We started to think up and brainstorm other names, and we nothing really clicked. It's everything we thought of sounded kind of generic or plain, and uh, and in our in our mind, Secret Ponchos was kind of taking over the name of the development blog was taking over the name of the project, and then one thing just led to another, and it became Secret Ponchos. And you know, some people when we first announced the game, some people really didn't like it, and some people loved it. But I think the one thing it has going for it is it's unique, and it really sticks in people's minds. So, Secret Ponchos, it is. That's the that's the story of the name. What do you guys think? Do you like the name, or uh, <laughs> do you, can you think of something else? Slapnap, are you on the PC version? Slapnap91 is saying he's been in queue for 50 minutes with no match. The PSN is down if you're on... PS4, but I can't even launch Secret Ponchos on my PS4, so I don't know if everyone's getting the same error message or not. But if you're waiting, if you're waiting more than a couple minutes, you should try re researching. Yeah, start researching, or or uh, if researching doesn't work, close it down and reopen it. You should definitely be getting into matches. I think he's searching in rookie. Oh, are you in rookie mode, Slapnap? We're all we're all playing in rank right now. No, nah, that's a good idea, Tony. Oh, Chevy. Hi, Chevy. Oh, hey, can opener. I didn't see you come into the stream. Hey, can opener. Yeah, the, the, we've got a good core of, of guys on the uh, PlayStation 4. Uh, you can, if you've been to our forum, you can probably see them all there, but. Uh, games seem to populate well whenever I pop in. You know, I'm I'm not waiting long at all to get games going, and uh, it seems like it seems like it's it's going really well. It'd be nice if the PSN network was up. This is like the best time for us with all the new people getting uh, PlayStations. Yeah, everybody's and, on holiday ready to play. And everyone's on holiday ready to play, and the PSN network's down. But what can you do about that, right? That's not anything we can control. So um, hopefully, in a Sony gets everything fixed up and, and, and good to go in the next day and people can spend the rest of the holidays playing Secret Ponchos and we can grow the community even more. But it's good, it's it's great. Like we've, we've had a lot, like the leaderboard, I don't know, I don't even know what the number is of the leaderboard, but it's it's in the six figures I think, so that's that's awesome. Yeah, Slapnap, we've, we've been talking about, um, uh, we've, we've been talking earlier about why the community is, or why the PC version is so much different than the PS4 version, basically just to update you, uh, oh, the, 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 the PC version is, um, early access, it's not a full release, whereas the PlayStation version is our full, full and final commercial release, so, they're very different games, and the people... We haven't done an, a big update on the PC in a long time. We have an update coming that's going to catch it up to everything on the PS4 version, and uh, maybe with a few added features that are PC-specific. But it's just a case right now of... Well, we, we're not a big enough team to 100% do both, so we've kind of been leapfrogging one over the other, and now that the PS4 version is in a good spot, we got a few things to fix on it still, tweaks here and there, but we're, we're working on the PC as well, and we'll have a big PC update coming.
and that community will be you know we'll be back to building that community up and there'll be lots of people playing the pc one as well i'm sure um and then when the final pc release comes we'll we'll be doing all kinds of stuff to have a huge following and huge community on there so just hang in there we'll uh the big improvements are coming to the pc version don't worry well and no you can't open it on ps4 if you bought it on steam they're, they're two totally different marketplaces and there's no way of well the ps4 uh, is free right now so yeah, yeah. Directly speaking, you could get it. Yeah, if you're a PS Plus member, it's free. Um. Yeah, there's a lot of um backlash with the early access thing because there are companies that make games that, unfortunately, doesn't really deliver what they promise, and and then so as a whole, um, the the tension to early access and Kickstarter has been it wasn't as like you know as good as before. So yeah, it's it's a really interesting problem because it's um, like for us it's been great. Early access is basically ensured that we're going to be able to make a final game. So for us, early access was was awesome. I, I know some people expect early like. Early access is basically for us. It was like a beta version of our game, where we've used that funding to put it back into the game, and now we can finish the game and make it a final. But I see a lot of games that don't make it out of early access, and I feel really bad for those people who bought a game and then it just died, and they never did a final version. Like that's that's just really too bad that that happens. So I can see both sides of the argument, but for us, it was it was a great thing to do, and it helped fix so many things in our game to have that big massive community that was like, engaged and talked to us and uh, really helped us build the game. I think that's one of the key things about Early Access that people don't talk about very much. Like, I would like to hear Total Biscuit's impression of um, the ability of the community to help the developers create the game um, in like a democratic kind of way where everyone has feedback. Because that, that's one of the best things about Early Access for us was to find all these balancing things, all these new ideas of how to uh, put features into the game, and it, it was really helpful. Yeah, gamer husband, I, I agree. I, I, but again, I don't know what the solution is. Um, Steam, I don't, I don't know how Steam could curate the quality any better. Like Steam is, is, yeah, I don't know. It's, it's really like at what point does a game? Would a game be okay for early access? Like Steam has been very part of their business model, I think, is to stay away from doing any kind of QA on their own. Like they don't have massive teams of people that do QA, and it's not like Sony or or Microsoft with the Xbox, where there's a you submit a game and it goes through QA. On Steam, it's kind of like the Wild West, where you just like put something up and go to it. So the, as part of their business model, they don't do QA. They could, do, could, they could do something similar to uh, the mobile market, where you, when you buy a game, you have like a couple hours to decide whether you think it was worth it or not. What, the, what do you mean? As a customer? As a customer, you can buy a game on the mobile networks, and then decide within an hour or two whether you feel it was worth the money, and then you can get a refund if you don't, if you don't, uh, if you didn't think it was worth it. I mean, the saddest thing about all that is there are, there like, well, there are a lot of indie companies or smaller company that really needed the funding to finish their project, and then they do have a pretty good game or an interesting concept of uh, what they want to do. And I think, I think, with like anything, you gotta, you gotta give the gut, like the customer something that they could try. I think, I think if they push it where you have to create a demo that's x minute long or an hour long or something and then people can try it out before supporting it i think that's totally fair because they are yeah. buying a broken game basically yeah no that's true and i think there needs to be more knowledge about um early access as well like i there's so many people that that purchase secret ponchos on steam and, and they didn't realize it was early access or that by purchasing an early access game they're actually getting a, the final game when it gets released as well. Like it, it, it seems like there's just not a lot of knowledge about how early access works either, which isn't helping the situation at all. 
I'm actually surprised the whole hatred thing happened just because it's like they took it down knowing that would create publicity and you know hits so the whole thing actually benefit them a lot like they got free marketing basically for the sounds something. a lot like the interview yeah yeah basically it was the best thing that could have happened to the game <laughs> I mean, I, my, my opinion aside of the what I think of the game, um, it was exactly, if you didn't want the game to be released, it was exactly the wrong way to handle the situation, I think. But, um, you know, it's always easy to see that stuff in hindsight. And when you're not involved in the process. Nice work, buddy. <laughs> oh man, Gary just burned us hard. <laughs> this is no offense here, but the devs surprised me by how they can make this game so competitively viable without being too good at it themselves. <laughs> um, too, too busy making the game. Yeah. That's my excuse anyways. I love that you body checked me after I was dead. We gotta organize a game between us and it's Gary. I don't think we're doing too bad. No. No. And the PC ver Gary, the one thing about the PC version that's difficult for us is that we've never had chance to to this sounds like an excuse, but it's <laughs> it's, <laughs> it is. it's a vi it's a viable excuse. We've never had a chance to get our characters up to like Deathbringer or Legend or anything like that, and the perk point system on the PC version is crazy. If you have a Deathbringer you're doing double or or, or like 2.5 times the damage of someone of a lower rank, so it makes a big difference actually. But there again, I, that sounds like an excuse. The guys on PC like uh, really Jin and Solo and Firecat, yeah, they're they're awesome. They're I, they're they're probably better than us anyway. But uh, but yeah, so thanks for that comment. <laughs> thanks for that burn. Yeah, Casper's probably Casper is Phantom is probably the most skilled of, uh, of all of us. That's just my personal opinion. And yeah, talking and playing is very difficult. I think uh, the one that one shot that I got hit by a uh, killer there took my health down to more than less than half. So I think he's a I think he's a Deathbringer. Got any health? <laughs> oh man, can opener. That's that's a rough introduction to Secret Ponchos. Your for your first day going solo against G <laughs> Giant. Ape. I got a I got a compliment on our Steam community for like you know being super proactive and getting the new players playing the game. So. Yeah, our community, both our community, like our community, the forum is, there's so, like, I, like there's probably, uh, like, I'm the, the forum admin, so I see all the complaints and, and stuff like that, and there's only been, like, one or two, like, insulting things in our forum. It's such an awesome community. When I go on to other forums for other games, there's so much, like, anger and, and negativity, and ours is so different. It's so full of positive, uh, positive people with, Good critic, like helpful criticism and um, putting up encouragement. Videos. Yeah, it's it's awesome. It's it it really it really makes a big difference to us. It, it like we love visiting the forum and getting feedback and talking to you guys, and it it makes a big difference. So thanks to uh, to all you guys who are out there taking part in the community because it, it really is making the game better for everybody. Yeah, gamer, I was the lost cause at the beginning. <laughs> but I, I played a lot of games at night um, with Jin and uh, Solo and Chivy and and uh, Can Opener and those guys. And they, 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 that was a school of hard knocks. They got me up to speed quickly in no time. If any of you guys are uh, are playing the Steam version and you're looking for games to play, just go into the uh, the chat, the game chat, 
and and Jin and Chivy and those guys are usually hanging out in there and just just talk to them and I, they're always raring to go for a game. Doll parts, all all those guys are, are raring to play a game and they're the best guys to learn from. They'll have you up to speed in no time. Hey Kelly, you wanna join my game so you can show off yeah, your yeah. skills? Yeah, sure. Um, in in the PSN, uh, PS4, the the Roki mode is still pretty populated. Um, so yeah, if you want to play Roki, you'll find more games there than the PC. A lot of our the PC guys are are pretty. They're all death bringers and stuff now. So except yeah, Jin likes to ruin people's day with his, with his dessert. What's uh, do you guys know what's the um what's the record bounty on the PS4 version right now? I think it was five hundred thousand or something. Jeez, that's incredible. Jin, you gotta get a PS4 just so you can get on that. I think he had dominate a, that leaderboard too. Twenty two a twenty two kill streak or something as well. well that's pretty good. Is it that death, death angel? Oh, they got me. They're, they're low. You down? Yeah, they're low though. Yeah, I'll wait for you to respawn. There we go. Look up behind you. Knife. Uh oh, I'm in trouble. Well, parts got me. I'm coming! Stay alive! Got him. Nice. Oh yeah. I took a knife, but keep them off me. Oh, they got me. Who's that killer? Shiny something. He's good. Yeah, never try to run away from the doll part. <laughs> he has too much speed and stamina. Hey, we got a lead. Uh oh. Uh oh. All tied up. Oh man, my dynamite went off at just the right time, eh? Did you get him? Yeah, I got stun off though. PC oh, build! Ugh! <laughs> no, hey, can uh, No, the art director uh, Jose Lopez uh, didn't work on Gorillas, but uh, he's uh, he's redesigned uh, Transformers, Teenage oh, Mutant no. Ninja Turtles, uh, Batman. Uh, any other ones I'm missing? You know, he's a super talented guy. It's great working with him. Good friend too. Need a heal. Already heal you. Uh oh, don't press got me. Am I lagging, Tony, or is that? No, I feel the like part. the dull part is a bit lagging. But might not be. Oh, come on, I'm moving out of there. Oh my god. 
Oh man. No parts. Ah, he's too fast. Hey, we, we talked about a uh, a mode where you you build a character and he has one life and you see how far how far you can go in matches. I got one of them. Get the all parts. Or part show mode. Oh, I did it! Uh, I think I got him. You did got him. Did we go, are we going to sudden death? No. One point. Oh, you got another guy. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, good game. Good game. Sorry, Jerry. I interrupted you there. No, no, it's all good. I was just, just saying how uh, early on we discussed the mode where uh, you build a character and he has one life and you see how far you can go through the game without dying. Yeah, like a hardcore mode, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, that would be awesome. Yeah. It'd be like a to like a totally special subset of ranks or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but one life. Fun. The pressure would be intense. Yeah, no kidding. What do you think? Do you think we would take off like all perk points and stuff too? Like it would just be like skill only? Yeah, we, I think it should be That's a great way to do it. No perk points. You just go in and try to win as many matches. We'll just you know what would be even crazier is if you did it and there was no stamina recharge. <laughs> like you only get three stamina or four stamina or whatever you start with and that's it. No, that wouldn't be as good. No, you... I think it'd be fun to try. Just but... start at the petty and see how far you can get. Yeah. I think each game you win you rank up one. So like a dev brain would be like ten games in. Oh, uh, there'd be a leaderboard. I think the leaderboard would be super interesting. Every day would it would be a totally different leaderboard. Every hour would be a totally different leaderboard. Unless there was one guy who was just like incredible. And I think it should be a one-on-one -on -one thing. Too. Yeah, one v one only. Yeah. yeah, especially because I don't think a ton of people would play that mode. So we don't want people sitting there and like matchmaking, waiting forever for someone to join their ultra hardcore. You wouldn't uh, want to rely on anybody either as a teammate. Yes. Yeah. No. You imagine totally getting knife in the back. <laughs> How angry you'd be. <laughs> you win, but you died. <laughs> Can you imagine how angry people would get with, uh, you know, we have that like, it, with a, like a disconnect <laughs> in the middle of a match. You've got like you've got like twelve wins in a row, and then uh, you get a disconnect or something. Oh man, that'd be brutal. You gotta you gotta put a warning. Make sure your internet is awesome before playing this mode. All right, while we're waiting for this match to start, I'm gonna do. Another, uh, another draw. Oh, wait. I lost my list. One sec. Uh, totally a double KO. Please what? At, at the hardcore poncho mode. Oh no no, the firecast just roll. Oh. Please devs, please. Oh, we got a match going. <laughs> it can't open, it's like, dude, I've accidentally TNT so many of my friends. <laughs> There's no accident, you wanted that kill. You wanted that kill. The soundtrack sucks, I can't find I'm a Barbie girl on it. <laughs> oh 
Oh man, we got let's go for a different map. Oh yeah, I haven't been, been voting. We should play some train wreck or something. I forget how big the hit volumes are. Oh yeah, I know. Oh, that's Jin. Who else is in this game? I just looked up when we were playing. Did you catch the name of the other guy? Oh my god, uh, Jin and Shiny guy. Oh. Uh oh, this is gonna be tough. Alright, let's group up. Let's win some games. Get him, he's, he's super low. Nice. Nice, we got him. Keep him separated. We're almost dead though, but... We can just keep them like, 2v1ing us. Oh, they teamed up. Let's see if I can get off some dynamite before I. Uh... Tony, how are you checking the uh, PSN connection? Uh, you can go on Google and type in PSN network status. Oh, yeah. Okay. That knife hitbox. Oh. It's so weird going from PS4 to PC. Yeah, it's totally different. Eh? The knife is super frustrating how huge the hitbox is. Oh, with my dying breath, I took out Shiny Knife. Still down. Yeah, I'm not surprised. They didn't even give an ETA. No, they're probably reworking their security. Brutal, eh? Imagine being like, getting a, being a kid and getting a PlayStation 4 for Christmas and not being able to play. Oh, so sad. Does every game require a network connection? Not every game, but most of them. Tony, we gotta get this score evened up. Yeah, <laughs> I just ate every knife that's been thrown. Get him! There, got Jin. Yes! Oh, he got me with a knife! Ah, oh, that's nice! There, he wasted oh, his bonus knife. So my, got one of them. Oh, ah. sorry, Kaylee. I mean, I mean, doing bad. Really? <laughs> yeah. I'm not you? Sure. Yeah, I'm feeling awful today. I play with the controller. <laughs> Jin. <laughs> <laughs> In next match, I'm gonna redeem myself. Oh, two and six, Tony. What happened? I know. I'm just. I don't know. <laughs> don't I'm worry. getting hit by the knife like a meter away. <laughs> oh my God! Knife hitbox. Yeah. Really <laughs> uh. Twizzy Kids is asking. We when are you asking when is Casper releasing tips and tricks? Oh, I see. <laughs> uh, yeah.
I don't know, after watching this stream, do you really want to listen to him? Yeah. Don't listen what's, to me. What's the alternative, though? Yeah, stupid devs is right, Jen. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Okay, let's vote, uh, let's map vote this, Tony. Yeah. Let's do train wreck. Oh, train wreck. Maybe that'll change up your luck. No, I'm just getting lazy with the knife dodge because on P on the PS4 I can just walk away, so I don't waste my stamina. But you can't do that in this one. Yeah, it's much more. Uh, the hitbox is a lot smaller on yeah. PS4. SL3X, I just noticed that the message. Uh, I don't think you got the Twitch message, so I'm sending you a new a new one with the soundtrack. Let me know if you have any problems. How many songs are on the soundtrack? Uh, 20? I want to say 20. Hold on. I'll tell you. 24. Awesome. Yeah, good value. I gotta get that. I still haven't got it yet. <coughs> Make it my phone ringtone. The lobby music? Yep. Because <laughs> you haven't heard it enough? Nope. I love this game. I love when I hear people. I hear people like complain about the time they spent in lobbies listening to that track, and if they had any idea what we go through in testing, <laughs> 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 for, like six or seven hours straight of like listening to that, like till two or three in the morning while we're trying to do matchmaking bugs. Oh man. How how? I think if we play like a thousand hours, probably six hundred of those hours are in the lobby. In the lobby. Yeah. Fixing, we're trying to fix the matchmaking. And then a hundred and a hundred or two hundred of those hours in different languages. Yeah. <laughs> trying to figure out what the menus say, if it's correct, and oh boy. Although, you know, we haven't had any like really big translation issues that we've heard of. Oh, so that's good. Yeah, except for the trophy not being Spanish. Right. But that's, you know, considering what we went through for the translation. It's actually, it's actually kind of amazing. Yeah. Hey, one more, guys. Search. Search. Two killers. Alright, I'm gonna dodge every knife ever thrown in this game. Oh, no, really? Two killers? Next patch, killers getting a 50% um, damage uh, nerf. Um, he can only throw knife once a game, <laughs> and he only has six shots. There you have it, from the devs. <laughs> Did you catch the names? Of who? These outlaws? Oh, it's Shiny and, um, oh, I don't know, who's the other one? We'll find out when we murder them. Yeah. All right. Let's win. Yeah. All right. Got my winning hat on. My winning some barrel. One killer is almost down. Yeah. Got him. Oh, nice. Oh, that ridiculous hitbox. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just took another one. Your turn? Man, I'm glad we fixed that. I'm just recharging stamina up in the hiding up in the train car. Oh, 
Oh my god. Stick my head, head out there. Right, Kaylee. They're coming for you. I was trying to lure them into the corner, but. Oh wow. Took a knife, hope you got him. Nice. Okay, I'm coming down to you. Oh no, you dead? Yeah. They're swarming me up here. Oh. Yeah, they're concentrating so hard. Yeah, it's scary. <laughs> oh man. Oh crap. We're in trouble, Tony. Yeah. Uh, we need some like, epic comeback music right now to inspire us. We're on the ropes. Oh man! No! <laughs> it wasn't even close. <laughs> Helmez, what, what kind of tips are you looking for with double in in the pocket? Uh, the best way I like to use it is, um, which you haven't seen me do today, but I like to stun and then switch to it and, and attach it to someone, especially if you're in a team game, because. Once it's attached, you get to watch them just sort of run like crazy. But stun shot, then attach the dynamite, and then kind of follow them at a distance, because when the dynamite goes off, they kind of get a second stun. So you can actually kind of combo it. So you do, you know, stun, dynamite attach, and then get a couple shots in when the dynamite blows and get out of there. And it's a, it's a pretty effective combo. Like I said, it's especially awesome when there's a team game, because the best thing ever is when they go like running towards a teammate, <laughs> or a teammate comes running by. You get them both. I like to hide behind covers too. Then. Mm, yeah, it's true. Something we didn't do much of today. And then, um, yeah. <laughs> I don't even have a kid red. Uh, my character's keep getting destroyed. Um, invited you, Kaylee. What do you think, guys? Last match? Sure. Or do you want to do one more with Jared after this, and I'll do a final raffle? Sure, let's do two more. Okay. I invited you, uh, Kaylee. Oh, I'm below 12 grand bounty now. These these streams are, are hard on my uh, self-esteem. <laughs> yeah, I think I lost at least 600 today. <laughs> yeah, Firecat, you should totally make a video with tips. Twizzy Kids is right. Will there ever be a kid blue? Like a twin brother? That'd be pretty awesome. Do do people really? I don't know. Do you do you think, Kelly, that the five death bringers too hard? I don't. I, I'm like the wrong guy to ask because I, I mean this is what I posted in the forum that I I've I've never actually played a game for trophies. Like it, it doesn't. It's kind of fun when you get one, but I don't. Um, but achievements, in, unless there was like some kind of weapon or something you get or. That, that's the only time that achievements have ever really meant anything to me. But I know people who like love getting 
like I have friends who love getting platinum trophies and stuff like that. And so to me, like a platinum trophy should be almost impossible to get. So I kind of like how hard the Deathbringer thing is, but I don't know. It, it would be crazy to get five Deathbringers. So I don't know if it's too hard or not. Like I see how fast some of those guys made Deathbringer. And I feel like, you know, maybe it's not like if it takes you like a month to get a Deathbringer and you do that five times, then that trophy really means something. But I didn't expect people to get so, um, people are so passionate about it. Like they, they really, I, I was surprised, I guess, at, at how much people, how many people wanted it different or, or easy to get. So I, I don't know. Uh, what do you think? You're, you're more of a competitive gamer than I am, I think. So I, 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 you know, what do you think? Well, I don't know. I'm, I'm all about, I, I, I'm not a trophy hunter by any means, but, um, if I really like a game, then I'll try to get everything. Then I'll try to complete it like 100% because I think it's it's a game that you know is worth my time. And usually, like for games like you know Skyrim or uh, I don't know, like the 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 Warcrafts and the Starcraft trophies to get all of them, like is it kind of impossible? Oh, not the Star um, Skyrim, it's totally possible. But um, the 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 Starcraft one, you have to like stay on Diamond League to win games and stuff. So. I mean, it is a competitive game, so I can see how some people would not be able to make get Deathbringers, but at the same time, I mean, it's really rewarding for the people that, um, that do get it, yeah. do get it, right? So, um, I don't, I don't know. When when we came up with the design, I kind of strongly push trophy as not. There's like games that come up really easy trophies, and people just play those games and quickly get trophies. And I, I didn't want that feel that. You no, know, Poncho is a trophy game, but um, but I mean, yeah, it's 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 really hard because you you make one group of people very happy, and one group of people really mad. Yeah, you, you know, the, I think the one criticism that I can think that I, is is actually the argument I haven't heard anyone make. The the one criticism of the five Deathbringer trophy is that if our game is competitive, and this is just my opinion. We're we're definitely going to talk about this internally, just. For anyone listening, this you know, we're we're nothing's decided. But my my opinion is like the I could see there being a problem with um, if we're making the game a competitive game where your rank is important and we've leveraged that to as like a uh, something that inspires you to play the game and rewards you. That by making you create other characters, it kind of pulls you away from fighting for your place in the leaderboard. You know, because you now have to split your time up to five different outlaws. So I could see that criticism. Like the the alternative to that would be to make it like get one million bounty or um, get five hundred thousand dollars bounty or something like that. Right. With with one outlaw, you know what I mean? Like, so I I don't know. We'll definitely Kili, talk about Kili, it. Short range fight. Don't don't let them get their distance. We... Two killers. Oh, okay. Stay close. Yeah. Stuns. What do you think, Jared? Um, well, yeah, trophies haven't really been a motivator for me. Um, but I, I understand the, the draw for people, uh, the bragging rights and uh, just, just, uh, just goals. Um, I, I agree with you where it uh, if we're if we're promoting being the best in the West, then Having people split split their time on uh, on multiple characters isn't necessarily the the way to to go. Um, I think we should definitely discuss uh, that trophy. Maybe it is uh, maybe it's reaching a uh, a bounty value rather than um, than having multiple deathbringers to have a deathbringer worth two hundred thousand or four hundred thousand or something or. Mm -hmm. that, maybe that's a, a better a better way to go. But um, yeah, it's definitely something we should uh, brainstorm, and, and we should, if we can, see see how many people have hit the gotten that trophy so far. And if people have recommendations, like a lot of you guys are experienced gamers and more experienced with trophies than us, so if you have recommendations, like join our forum and. That's the best way, or, or I mean our Twitch stream, but also join our forum and communicate with us. We're we're always open to talking about it, and it helps us, you know. 
There may be solutions we haven't thought of. Okay, we're, we're doing okay, Tony. We're still in this. Uh oh, get out of there! Yeah, I got stunned. Is that my dynamite? No, I, I, I keep bouncing back in. I cannot wait to play these guys when we fix that knife hitbox. <laughs> I need a heal if you've got one. Yeah. Oh, did you use it? Yeah, I already used it. Oh, awesome. Hey, Felix Knight. Can you run to me? Oh. No, they they got me on. They, they pincer attacked me. Ah! Okay, I'll wait for you. Yeah, I have no stamina. That can get away. Uh oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Look out, I dropped the dynamite! Oh yeah, I got one the dynamite, charge him! Yes! Two more kills, three! Three more kills in 20 seconds! We got this! No, we don't get this. No. No! 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 Oh man. Okay, maybe you and Jerry can salvage this. Last uh, last match of the day. What's going on in the chat? Lots of apologies. I don't know. I was so busy, stressed out about our match, I wasn't reading the chat. Love, not hate. Yeah. <laughs> what does Yoda say? Fear leads to anger, anger leads to hate, hate needs leads to suffering. Suffering leads to not playing video games. Yeah. Oh, you're still in my lobby. Oh, no, that's you. Me? No, 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 just share it. Yeah, we just let you guys debate PC versus PS4 <laughs> <laughs> until until name calling what be, starts. What would, what would be awesome is if we could uh, combine the uh, uh, the servers so that yeah, uh, people last, PS4 yeah. can battle against the PC. Then Does a game mode or PC versus yeah. yeah. I like different things about them. I like that when I play on, I like like I like laying back and with a controller on sitting on the couch and and playing the console. But you know, I the, the PC is, I don't know, it's totally different. PC feels like I'm sitting in. It's probably just my setup, but I feel like the PC is more like uh, it's more intense because I'm sitting staring at it <laughs> in work mode, and I'm like lying on the couch all lazy when it's uh, yeah, I think well console well, mode. At least, at least the devs pretty much all work in front of a computer all day, so it changed our perspective of what a PC is. Also, my PC is terrible compared to my uh, like a PlayStation Four is a is, is 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 like a much more powerful machine than my PC. It's my PC is just limping along these days, so that doesn't help my uh, my opinion either. I think I spend about 15 hours a day at least in front of my PC. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Play more. I just need one more. One more. 
Yeah, Cole, we, we hear you. That, that's why we're uh, that's why we're talking about changing the, the Deathbringer trophy. We it's not something that um, it's not a mentality that we properly understood at the beginning. But I mean, the community is, has communicated with us, and we plan on addressing it and trying to fix it in in the near future. There's not not much else we can do. I guess I guess we were just promoting um, people to try out and master each character. That was the goal of that trophy. But uh, yeah, again, listen to the community, see what they want. Yeah, I think the the reason why we did it basically was to make sure you know for like I don't know those top Evo guys, um, Street Fighter Evo guys. They they know every character inside out. They. Um, they, they, they play each character so much, and all the frames all the time, I mean, to put that much dedication to one game is, is really good, and for us, we feel like um, this game could be something that, you know, you could learn each character really well, but I, yeah, like, I guess none of the devs are really um, trophy hunters, so, um, you know, it's probably hindsight, like, we just don't really, we felt like it was something to make people feel really good when they get it, but we kind of didn't really think about the the trophy hunter guys and how they want their I don't know easier I guess um, achievements and stuff. I don't I don't think we should go. I think if we're going to change it, we shouldn't go just easier, but more focused around maybe one or uh, just your overall bounty score. Still still promoting playing a ton, but not necessarily having to split up your focus. But anyways, that's uh, another discussion to have. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll be talking about that for sure. Let's focus, last game. Oh, both dead. Okay, draw. The winner is the silence one. Wow, nicely done. Or beefy Bob. Beefy Bob, yeah. What? Congrats. Oh, lagging. Like yeah, it's... I don't know. I can't even move. <laughs> I was about to shoot and I got thrown across the screen. I like how, uh, how Beefy Bob asks for soundtrack, a soundtrack raffle, and he wins. On my screen, he just whipped four times in one second. Good game. Yeah, <laughs> let's do one more. That was pretty, <laughs> pretty uh, weird. Is it over already? Watch, watch yeah. the thing. Yeah, I, was, I keep getting stuck. I'm, uh, I'm giving out Christmas presents right now. I'm busy. <laughs> Soundtrack Christmas presents. We got one more. Uh, our, uh, our, our, our sound elf works so hard on. Wonder if um they when the game lags on the other guy or are we just standing there? I'm not sure what the uh, the network code is on on uh, the PC. Okay, we'll do it for reals this time. All right, for reals. Which map do you want to play? Uh, let's do ranch. Let's play the ranch. Um, silence. Uh, the uh, the track is. Uh, the music is same for PC and PS4. I mean, there's some changes and updates since the PS4 one. So it, I guess the PS4 is the more recent one, and the soundtrack has those music. Yeah, there's new tracks in the in the PS4 one for sure. Um, yeah, I think. PC, PS4 is all the same. 